Good day and welcome back to another DBZ Deck Metal video. In this video we're going to be taking a look at the Universe 7. Uh, well, basically the Universe 7, reps of Universe 7 team uh, for Burst Mode. Now, I'm going to be honest, this team is heavily, heavily reliant on the Int Powerful Comeback Vegeta. You can probably do a variation with the AGL Goku, but you're going to have to make things slightly harder for yourself. Although overall Goku is probably better because he has already natural type advantage against Jiren. But this build is almost entirely reliant on the damage output of two Easy Aid Int Vegetas. Now getting a friend lead one is not a problem. Having your own one, that could be an issue. If you don't have your own one, then I highly suggest you look at a variation of this team or maybe look at All Out Struggle, which could be done with an Int Vegeta if you have your own Int Super Saiyan 4 Goku. Now, how this team works is basically you have two double Int Vegetas. Like I said, you don't need the physical Blue Boys. They do help, their damage does help, but I actually push them off rotation a lot of the times because we need to facilitate the revive mechanisms just in case we get in trouble. The big difficulty that a lot of players are going to face in this battle is that Jiren in his final phase locks your positioning. He will randomly lock one of your units. So what tends to happen is you go through a run perfectly fine, your Vegeta's dominate everything, then your Vegeta is instantly locked into slot two, you immediately lose because your other unit gets hit and you're basically done. How we avoid this is essentially by making sure that we have revives. So we're going to have a Master Roshi on one rotation, we're going to have a Vegeta on the other rotation, uh, Vegeta on both rotations obviously. That gives us lots of security with revive elements. And on top of that we're going for pure evasion. So we have like Int uh, UI Goku here, UI Sign Goku. If we fall below a certain health threshold he'll have guaranteed dodge. We have Physical UI Goku which is a free to play unit that has dodge. Master Roshi along with his revive has dodge. The only unit that doesn't have dodge is the physical Android 17 and the blue boys. Now like I said you can replace the blue boys, you can also probably replace physical Android 17. If you have a int Android 17 and 18 they are going to do wonders here uh, mainly because of their ability to buff the rest of the rotation. So lots of really really good stuff there uh, but yeah in general going to be honest uh, a really 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 straightforward um, situation. So I think for me definitely 100% uh, uh, Vegeta is a huge factor uh, in you know this event clearing this burst mode. He does huge damage using his active skills save one active skill for the second to last red phase phase uh, save the other active skill for the final strength phase all of this is super duper important stuff so that's kind of it uh, realistically speaking I mean that's really that's really it I do find that the uh, reason the Universal Survival Saga 1 is easier or the Reps Universe 7 challenge is easier than the All Out Struggle challenge is because you have access to so many revives so they both All Out Struggle and Reps of Universe 7 are heavily reliant on either the physical blue boys or int vegeta or in the reps of universe 7 case you have access to agl goku in all out struggle you don't have access to as many units you're a little bit more reliant on units like gtss4 uh, goku who's fine but i mean just in general you are a little bit more limited uh, which is obviously the idea but for me the accessibility to the revives and the numerous revives and the dodging units and the support units really allows the reps of Universe 7 team to just be a little bit easier. We've got free to play Roshi, we've got free to play uh, UI Goku, we've got you know summonable Android 17. So it just feels like we have uh, enough you know variation of units to make this a relatively accessible team. Like I said, uh, you will need your own Int Vegeta. Hopefully you should have him. Uh, he's quite accessible now on a lot of uh, banners, been on a lot of banners. You could get him with red coins if you really want to. I mean, there's a lot of ways to get him, so yeah. Uh, but yeah, then you know, that's that's it really. Um, honestly, Vegeta, really, really good. This run 
nice and smooth. You can obviously get into trouble if one of your revives doesn't kick in. Don't panic, just reset. You'll eventually get the luck you need, um, especially when it comes to dodging and stuff like that. But yeah, don't panic. One, two, maybe a third run, but you'll get that luck eventually. You'll get the win. So yeah, that's it from me. I uh, hope you guys enjoyed the video. For this one, we only had to score uh, 6,000, so that's great. And uh, yeah, bye.